I'm going to cover some more in-depth description of the new UDV component uh, to bridge Playmaker and the new UI uh, from Unity. First, I would like to talk about this Playmaker UDV prefab that uh, you'll need to have on your project. This is basically a way to create by default a series of events that you will be able to use in your project without having to create them. You need them if you want to set FSM. You don't need them if you want to set variables, only if you want to send uh, events. So, let's create a button. And you notice that when you create a button in Unity, it wants everything to be in a canvas. And for uh, flexibility, uh, the proxy uh, for Playmaker can be outside this canvas. So, we can create an FSM controller and in there define how we're going to connect the UI components and Playmaker together. You don't have to host it on the component itself, it can be elsewhere. So let's have the proxy. Okay, and so it says I haven't found a valid UI component. Of course, it's somewhere else. So let's specify it and we want the button. Now it found it and it wants now an FSM to be able to send that event. So let's create an FSM even on another game object. FSM logic. And let's create there an FSM. My FSM. And so from the controller, which now targets a button, this button, I can specify a game object, which will be the FSM logic and create on that FSM logic a global transition of UGUI on click. So you see those custom events are actually defined in the Playmaker UGUI. So they are already there for you. There and FSM controller. So yes, now the proxy is looking at a button and wants to send a UGUI on click event to the FSM logic that is there. Let's see if that could work. Okay, that works. You've noticed also that <clears throat> you don't have to target a game object, you can actually broadcast. So you could broadcast an event, you agree on click or something else. Uh, my own button click. Okay. And anywhere else, create that event. My own click. Turn it into a global. My own button click. And so the FSM controller is going to watch this button and broadcast to all FSM my own button click. So the one that will implement that global event my own button click will receive it. 